More than a thousand motorcycles took over Vatican City on Sunday. Their revving was music to the ears of Pope Francis, who gave a blessing to Harley Davidsons and their riders. You love this story, I don't do, you? I do. <laughs> I just would love to have been there. Love to have been oh, yeah, there. Yeah, right. Yeah. See the Pope. Exactly. And then see him get on a on a Harley and ride off. Yes, I don't think we saw the Pope on the Harley, <laughs> no, but Alan Pizzi has happen. the story for us, so here he is. The trademark smile was as big as ever, but Pope Francis' tour down the Via della Conciliazione had a soundtrack that was unique, as were those he blessed. 1,400 Harley-Davidson motorcycles and their owners lined the route, a highlight of a three-day rally to mark the 110th anniversary of the quintessential American brand. Dean Wirtz from Two Rivers, Wisconsin, took time off from his U.S. defense contract uh, job in France. Germany. Uh, we came to do the Harley rally, and then we uh, were fortunate enough to take in mass with the Pope, so it was great. So, which is more, which was, which was better to you, the mass or the Pope or the, or the rally? Well, I can't say that. <laughs> you know, uh, they were, both were great. The vests, badges, and slogans are emblems of a club rather than an outlaw lifestyle. An exhaust setup to do this is about as extreme as it gets. Swiss rider Bernard Bouchy has been a biker for 52 years. He bought his first Harley a decade ago. Why, why, why did you change to a Harley? What's so special about a Harley? Because I'm old, and uh, now I don't drive so fast. It's much easier. You, you sit on the Harley and you travel around the world. And it corresponds to a, a period of the life. Huh? For the record, he's 70, just a little younger than the Pope. Francis was given an official Harley jacket and two classic bikes last week. These bikes and those who ride them are a far cry from the Hell's Angels image so long associated with Harleys, but one had the distinct impression Pope Francis wouldn't have minded either way. For CBS This Morning, Alan Pizzi, Rome. As you said, hard not to like this Pope. Yes, exactly. <laughs>